Hello everyone, this is Empress Pamela. Welcome to this edition of Tarot and Oracle Deck Review. So my pile of, or my collection of decks to be reviewed is dwindling down, but that doesn't mean I have saved, I have or have not saved the best for last. Um, there are a couple of really um, nice ones, popular ones, maybe ones that you're not familiar with. So um, let's dive in. This, today, we are going to be looking at Doreen Virtue's Angel Therapy Oracle Cards, a 44-card deck. I acquired these on Poshmark. I started off as a Poshmark seller, and then I became an avid buyer over the last couple of months. I have expanded my collection. And if you haven't tried Poshmark, um, it's a great website if you want to buy or sell. Become a seller, clean out that closet, get rid of some things, declutter, do some Marie Kondo this fall, and redo your wardrobe. Renew your wardrobe. Reinvent yourself. Why not, right? So these are Angel Therapy Oracle Cards by Doreen Virtue. Now, um, I've done all of my... The one the tarot cards that I currently have, I've done all the um, videos for that. So check the playlist, see what I did. If you have any recommendations, I'm trying to open this box without ripping it. Um, if you have any recommendations for cards, some of your favorite decks or decks you might be interested in but not sure if you want to purchase yet, let me know and I'll see if I can get them. On Poshmark, or you can do the same. Use coupon code Empress Pamela, all one word. Get ten dollars for free, and the um, garbage man is coming down the street, so it may get a little loud, which I apologize in advance. Now, these I don't have a uh, what do you call it a, a guidebook or anything like that. I guess you can um, scan that code and get something online if you want, but I'm just going to present the cards. This is the back of the deck, right? And then show, read and show you the messages. And maybe you'll see if you want to uh, invest in these. Um, probably didn't cost me that much, to be honest with you. I love using Poshmark because you can barter, negotiate, bid on things. It's really cool. Archangel Michael, everybody likes Mike. Ha ha. You're working very closely with this powerful Archangel who's protecting and guiding you through this situation. So these cards are wonderful to be used um, as a compliment or um, clarifier or guidance for any kind of... Um, messages that you are doing through tarot or other oracle decks. Beautiful. Archangel Raphael. Ascended Masters. Base Chakra. So, maybe you have a base chakra that is blocked. Choose only positive thoughts to describe your home, career, and finances as your words determine your outcome. There's always a reason why I choose to read some cards and not others. And typically, and I, what I think is um, personally, it's a personal message for me right now because I'm under so much stress. But um, yeah, think positively. Okay, I'll do my best. Be willing to forgive. Yes. The Ho'oponopono. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. I love you. Simple Simon Metapyman. 
Forgive yourself first. Okay. As uh, <laughs> Gemma from Gemstone Tarot says, the F word, forgiveness. Books. Your life purpose involves writing, reading, editing, or selling spiritually based books. Yes, again, there's a reason why I read these things. It applies to me most likely. And probably some of you out there needed to hear that. If there's a book you've always wanted to write, if that's one of your lifelong goals, get started. No time better than the present, right? Tomorrow's not guaranteed. Hate to tell you. Cancel, clear, delete. Clear yourself. Crown chakra. Crystals, my favorite. The energy of crystals supports you and helps with your present situation. Well, if you haven't checked out my other videos, I have a playlist called You Need This Crystal. Over 170 videos of my collection of crystals. Yes, I own more than 170 video of uh, 70 crystals. Um, they're not big. They're small. I just like variety. And I wanted to share with you um, the power of crystals. So check it out. And I have some oracle decks. I did a video this morning of uh, crystal oracle decks. And then I've got another one right here. The crystal wisdom healing. Yes. Crystals have been a part of my spiritual journey. Learning about knowing, collecting crystals. And um, yeah, it's been a thing. Cut your cords. Ear chakras. Okay, <laughs> I'm going to read this one and then I'm going to tell you why I read it. It's funny. Oh, sh this camera has been a pain. Okay, ear chakras. Mamma mia. Okay. Notice messages that appear as sounds, music, and words from both external sources and within your mind. These messages are real answers to your prayers. Okay. Ear chakras. I've got a number of health issues. And yesterday, I went to a place that it's called Miracle Ear. They will do free evaluation of your hearing. And my hearing in my left ear has basically been non-existent for months, but I've had other health issues to deal with. So the hearing, for some reason, was the last thing to tackle on my list. Anyway, the guy looked in my ear. He said, whoa, you've got a blockage of earwax and I can't do the exam. But my mom, who's 82, was with me, and she's been evaluated, and she has hearing loss over the last couple of years, but she refuses to get um, <laughs> devices, hearing stimulators. So while we were there, they examined her. And anyway, bottom line, she ends up getting the, we're calling it new earrings or diamond earrings, which are really hearing aids, but she doesn't like the idea of having it. I <laughs> went, they said, you need to go down to urgent care and they'll do a, I think it's called visage or something. I don't know. There's a term for the procedure. Anyway, I got it cleared. Holy crap. The size of my earwax blockage in my left ear was um easily I want to say a quarter of an inch pretty long I even took a picture of it. it's gross but I couldn't hear for so long and luckily there's no other obstruction because I was worried that um a foreign object like an ear one of those rubber things <sighs> When you're listening to earphones, sometimes they come off. I thought it was lodged in my ear, honestly, and I was afraid to tackle that. But it was all taken care of by, um, it took a long time. I think she syringed my ear. Well, first she puts hydrogen peroxide, and I had to lay on my right side because it's my left ear for about 15 minutes. 
And then she had to wash it like, I forgot what the term is. It's not wash it. Like using a syringe, she did it about seven or eight times. Yeah. And then when it was just about to pop out, it was like birthing a baby coming out of my ear. It was painful at that point when it was like just coming out. So I was crowning in my ear. Anyway, holy crap. I can't believe I went on that um, tangent. But uh, yeah, now I can hear and it's like crazy. So I ticked that one off my list, but I got a lot of others on my physical healing list. So we'll do one at a time, right? Earth Angel, you are a light worker who has come to Earth to teach about love. Yeah, love yourself. Take care of your health. Don't freaking put it on the wayside. <sighs> Seriously. I got, I'm talking to myself guys. Um, as much as I talk about health and I know the right things to do, but it's like, I get in such a low point emotionally, like depression and all that. And all that shit goes out the window. Look at emotional sensitivity, honor and respect your deep sensitivity, sensitivity as it is a gift to us all. You know how many times I cried yesterday? Oh God, I didn't even tell you this part. So we're in Miracle Ear and they put a demo in my mom's ears. And the gentleman takes me out in the hallway. So she was in an office. He takes me out in the hallway, which was like 20 feet away from her. And he said, ask your mom a question or whatever the question was. And she actually heard me and I couldn't believe it. I started crying. Then he takes me 10 feet further and he says, ask her another question. And I did. And I was bawling my eyes out because this is affecting. So if you have elderly parents, when they start losing their hearing, there's no stimulation of the cilia in your cochlea ear, your ear, right? The, the, um, there's no sound going to the brain for her to brain to translate. So basically her brain is not functioning correctly because she's there. She's not getting the messages and her memory has been affected. Her short term memory is like crap. And I thought as, as she was saying over the last couple of years, I don't remember. I don't remember. Here I'm thinking she's playing games, not 100% of the time, but I'm like, you don't remember what you had for dinner last night? It's becoming like that. I'm like, holy shit. And so this um, ears, <laughs> the de ear device, the new earrings are really an investment for her so that it will slow down her Alzheimer's and improve her memory capacity. So if you have elderly parents, another suggestion. Wow. I didn't realize this was going to be this type of reading, but anyway, I'm going to include it because somebody needs to hear this message. It's serious. Fairies. God box. Oh, let me write, let me read this. This is unusual. Write any worries, concerns, or desires on a piece of paper that you put in a special container called a God box as a way of letting go and allowing the divine to help you. Wow, nice suggestion. Goddess, beautiful artwork. Look at that. Have you asked your angels for help with this? Well, I will be asking my angels for help with a lot of this. Heal away addictions. <sighs> Who doesn't need that? Heart chakra. If you get nervous, focus on service. Hmm. Indigo. Integrity. Law of attraction. Listen to your intuitive feelings. Manifestation power. Mediumship. Parents. 
past life issue. Power animal. Release. Sacral chakra. Shield yourself. Singing and dancing. Solar plexus chakra. Third eye chakra. Throat chakra. Twin flame. Oh, I'm going to read it just because. The answer to your question involves a spiritually based romantic relationship. Hmm. Vacuum away fear. Vegetarian, vegan. Oh, my son is vegan. Fresh organic fruits and vegetables give you a boost of high life force energy, which elevates your spiritual frequency. So, um, yeah, I told you about my fitness pal, right? Did I, was it this video? Anyway, I don't remember. Oh, revisiting my nutrition. I wanted to lean towards being pescatarian. Uh, I've been studying, not studying, well, engaged with the Mediterranean diet. And then there's this gentleman, Dan Butner, who wrote about the five zones, the blue zones where people live in excess of a hundred years. A lot of, I guess, centenarians, maybe it is. Um, and what their diets are and their habits and so forth. Um, but yeah, in fact, I did a quick memo on my phone last night and wrote down all of the types of foods that I will allow in my body from now on in the hopes of trying to uh, have a more healthy um, body, live longer, right? Visualize success. See yourself doing well in this situation and have faith in a positive outcome. Well. I will be successful in my weight loss journey. Workshops and seminars. You are a powerful light worker. You are profoundly clairvoyant. Trust what you see in your mind's eye as well as with your physical sight. For your spiritual vision helps you with healing, teaching, and guidance. Amen. Right? This is... Angel Therapy Oracle Cards by Doreen Virtue. I love the guidance and the messages on this. Simple, straightforward. Add this to your collection. You won't regret it, right? I, I like this deck. Really pretty. And um, <laughs> insightful, right? There we go. All right. Take care like and subscribe. Look forward to my um, next couple of videos. If you haven't seen my previous ones, take a look. Look at my playlist. All right. Thank you for joining me. Take care.